Good evening. Good evening, Isabel Cerecedes. I'm the chairwoman for Prescott Valley Citizens Alliance. On behalf of Prescott Valley Citizens Alliance, we want to congratulate and welcome Councilman Matt Zercher and Ken Frond to the council. Thank you for your willingness to serve our community. In an email dated December 7th of 2023, almost a year ago, the board of directors for PVCA called on the town manager and council members to establish a code of conduct and ethics policy for elected leaders. And I had the clerk uh, give you a copy of that letter. We'd never received a response or an acknowledgement. However, we understand that the town is now considering to adopt an ethics policy for elected leaders. This is a step in the right direction. It's greatly needed. Without a good ethics policy, there is no accountability. I want to stress that a stern talking to does not advance good policy. We ask that there is progressive discipline and an independent ethics review commission appointed and that they have the ability to administer strict penalties for, for violations. Because of the town reporting structures, it is not wise to have someone who is not impartial making decisions. Those who serve at the pleasure of council are conflicted. We ask again that an independent ethics review commission be appointed. And those are usually three to five members. On another note, at one of the last council meetings uh, during the vote for the Lakeshore 650, which is very controversial, people that were in the audience or if you were, were watching remotely, we could not see how council people were voting. And I think that's a disservice to the community. So I'd like to ask in the future whether or not you have technical difficulties that you do a vote call so we actually know how our elected leaders are voting. Thank you so much for your time tonight. Thank you, ma'am.